All right, it's time to get you know it's a more mass effect of summer. So yeah, we're, we have some unfinished business here. And our first priority is to... I can get Samara, or the hack the security the system. First hand, our Spectre would play by the rules. This one has forgotten whether its heat sink is over capacity. It wonders whether the criminals... We were always told that Ilium is one of the safest places in the galaxy, until you fell off the grid. Sign the wrong contract, join up with the wrong company, or walk down the wrong alley, and it's as dangerous as anywhere else. Don't let this place fool you. It's no safer here than Omega. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. <clears throat> I spent the last two years here. I had a purpose, a goal. Now that I've accomplished it, something occurs to me. In all that time, I never looked at the horizon. It is spectacular. Damn it, Shepard, I trusted you. I trusted you and you screwed me over. Not my problem. Is it? I'm in the middle of an important call. This might be worth putting your family on hold. Here's that data you were worried about. Is that the Carosa Generational Archive? Oh, I am so sorry for being rude. My whole family has been worried. That data is irreplaceable. I didn't think I'd get it back from Nasana's corporate building. If this data is so important, why didn't you have backups? We did. A rival family introduced a computer virus and our techs were sloppy. The virus destroyed all our data. I just spent a fortune getting the data recovered and reconstructed when Nasana went crazy. We live in a world of infinite data redundancy. To lose something so important because of one crazy Asari? Why is this data so important anyway? It's a genetic history for the entire Carosa family. It's used for high-level reproductive negotiations. It would be like a human pedigree, I suppose. Without it, you're bargaining from a greatly weakened position. Losing this would have hurt my family for generations, maybe even destroyed it. There's your data. I hope it helps your family. You have no idea, human. I, I don't know who you are or how you got it, but thank you. Here, for your trouble. Blessings be upon you. You've certainly blessed us. Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know, some of them seem dangerous. That's the whole point. Danger means more contract work for us. Alright, so there's a very short time yeah, between. No, I haven't had any luck yet. She insists it was legal. Welcome to Baria Frontiers. Our sales kiosk is over there.
Shepard. I... I don't suppose you'd remember me. I'm Shiala. We met on Pharos during the Geth attack. Saren had given me to the Thorian creature as a slave, and you killed it, and saved me. I promised to help Zeus Hope recover. I'm actually here on Ilium for just that purpose. How is Zeus Hope doing? We've done a lot of rebuilding. We even salvaged some useful material from the Geth ship you destroyed. The Exogeny researchers got called back to their headquarters, however, along with what was left of the Thorian. Is it Exogeny pushing colonists around again, or did the Thorian somehow survive our fight? No. Exogeny has been very supportive of Zeus' hope. They actually seem to want to help us survive, and the Thorian is dead. Though, after all you went through to kill it, I understand your concern. I fear that after our adventure on Pharos, my purpose on Ilium will seem mundane by comparison. What are you doing here on Ilium? Some of the colonists had health problems as a result of the Thorian control. We hired a colonial survey group to do some medical scans. But the medical contract apparently allows the company to perform invasive procedures without our consent. That's why I'm here. Tell me more about the contract you signed for these scans. Barrier Frontiers was interested in our problem. They offered to perform medical scans and deliver treatment for next to nothing. I should have known it was too good to be true, but we were desperate. In the fine print, we apparently agreed to let them perform invasive follow-up procedures if they deem it valuable, which they have. Can they actually force these procedures on you? No. But they can declare us in breach of contract, which means we're responsible for the full price we would have paid normally. Zoo's hope just got back on its feet. There's no way we can afford that, Shepard. Wait a minute. Shiala, you were only green when the Thorian made you a clone. The real you was blue, like normal Asari. Those health problems, I said, were related to the Thorian control. This is mine. A few months after the Thorian died, my skin pigment changed. My biotic abilities are unstable as well. I'm also having vivid dreams about my time with the Thorian. It is disconcerting. What kind of health problems did the colonists have? Headaches or muscle spasms similar to what they experienced while under Thorian control. Sometimes the colonists near another former Thorian victim shared sensations like heat or pain. It has to be a result of trace amounts of the Thorian's parasitic spores. You can see why we'd want it studied and cured. I'll talk to the survey group. I appreciate it, Shepard. The Barrier Frontier's representative knows about the issue. Oh, I already had to care of that, so... I saw your conversation, human. You're here to complain about the medical contracts those colonists from Pharaoh signed. I suggest you leave. Your life is short enough. Do not waste what time you have bothering me. Why are you insisting on these tests? What use could they possibly be? Their use is not your concern. A legal binding contract was signed. Nothing else matters. All of you. Humans. Salarians. Turians. You come to our planet, then complain that our laws don't suit you. The galaxy would be a better place if nobody but the Asari had ever dragged themselves out of the primordial muck. Perhaps we could work out different tests. Something that will work for both sides. If the colonists were not willing to abide by the terms of the contract, they should not have signed it. The onus is not upon me to accommodate them. So you'd be this harsh in your contract terms if these were Asari colonists? If they were Asari, they'd be dealing with problems unleashed by another race. A sorry like my bondmate, who died when the Geth rebelled against the Quarians. Or my daughters, who died during the Geth attack on the Citadel. One worked in the embassy, the other was a greeter for the consort. I'm not speaking in hypotheticals, human. The aliens will never be my allies. 
The best they can do is give me useful medical data. Why was your bond made on the Quarian homeworld? Studying the Quarians. Not their technology, but their music. She loved all their art. Said they had old souls. I think that's where my daughters got it from. Both of them love talking with people, exploring new cultures. They sound like wonderful people. The galaxy is lesser for their loss. Yes, it is. Do you think they'd want you to do this? I I'm not. A I didn't. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what happens when you get exposed to the truth. It hurts. I'm sending an amended contract. No more tests, no fees. There's enough grief in this galaxy. I don't need to add to it. <laughs> Did you get the star charts? Yeah. I had to deal with Arinya, though. I feel like I need a shower. What do you expect? She's a pure blood. They're all like that. You did it. I just got the revised contracts. Thank you, Shepard. You've saved Zeus' hope again. I don't think I could have. Is it always like this? Yesterday's problems lingering in some new form. Isn't anything ever just fixed? You've got the new contracts. It's fixed for now. With Thank you for what you've done here, now. Shepard. I'll keep doing what I can. Maybe sometime when I'm not organizing the colony and you're not doing whatever you do. Um, yeah, I already have a, uh, I already have a soulmate in Liara. You know Irinya won't even talk to the non-Asari customers. It's like she's turned pure blood into her religion. I'm telling you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse mercs, some Justicar, I don't know. Nobody is ever going to see the extra merchandise. Which is why we're going to be rich. I'm on a call. It's to my boyfriend. You're sure gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? Yeah, I've got a friend in Eclipse. She told me what I needed to get. Good. I'm pretty good at bypassing firewalls. Maybe they're looking for techs. Oh, blue rose. Of what about the stores over there? And don't get cute. The whole place is monitored. Damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. The Krogan is reading those love poems to get your attention? His name is Char. We're kind of dating, but, well, we're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. Why are the two of you on a break? He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. It made me wonder if he really likes me. Or if he just wants kids. He can't have them any other way, you know. 
because of the genophage. It doesn't seem common for Asari to be a Krogan. What brought you two together? He's a fun guy, really smart, especially for a Krogan. And he's got a good job as a transport technician. It's fun to join a mercenary guild or dance at bars for a few centuries, but eventually you hit the matron stage, you know? Then you get your back tattoo removed, let your scalp go back to its natural blue, and settle down with someone dependable. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Listen, he's a Krogan. Any talk about kids is gonna mess him up. I know. You can't talk to Krogan about the genophage. They get so angry. If you settle down with him, you'll spend the rest of your life wondering if he was after you or kids. Yeah, you're right. I guess I needed to hear somebody else say it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. What about a fish? She loves the garden. We could add a pond. She doesn't need a fish, Dad. All right, um, hmm. okay, there's some more notes here. I got a hack, maybe a shirt or a card. Helium, hey, you're blue shifting already. That's funny, right? A sorry skin color. I think there's either three or there's four of these things I have to hack. But two are already example, in the same you know area. Drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. Mm -hmm. She's the last of a dying breed. Won't be many pure blood as already left in a few generations. Is there any more maps I, I can buy? No. Right. Her. Don't. I heard she married an Asari herself. Had pure blood kids. She's part of the problem. You can sell something that dangerous with just a contract and a waiver? These are the Terminus systems. Everything's dangerous. Just recently and received an unexpected sale. visitor in the form of a rare Jessicar calling herself Samara. Samara denied her. I need minimal heat increase and speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. Coming up later today, we release our annual list of Ilium's 10 richest people. Are the heavens still bright? I'm gonna have that asshole arrested. Go to eternity. Oh, that's right. I think I have to, uh... That's right. I think I have to, uh... Talk to Connor again. And he says... Oh, it's a... You're really holding out on me? I'm a man... You want to see how far I'll go? Oh, I have to do this Commander again. Commander Shepard? Hey, if you know this idiot, can you rein him in before I slap his Shepherd? ass? Is it real? Oh, uh, and then you shoved a gun in... So you're alive, huh? I hear it goes like that in the biz. Why don't you sit back and watch how it's done? I got some asses to kick. Conrad. Ha! Kick him in the quad! Sorry, my father was a Krogan. Man, I should have gotten... Anyway, get angry if you want, but somebody had to do something. 
You were dead. I stepped up. Conrad. I think we went through this the last time, so I'm just gonna skip Galaxy all this. Needed someone like you, Shepard. We all did. I had to do something. I don't want to repeat. How did you get that arm? Well, getting the whole getup was pretty expensive, but my wife was really supportive. She even paid for my shuttle fare off world. I like how she so shakes her like wander the galaxy, riding wrong. I'm with you on that one, Bartender. Hey, don't say it like that. I talk to people, you know. Ask them if they have big problems that only I can solve. You'd be surprised how many people are just waiting for someone to talk to them. Oh, I bet. Sometimes I poke through crates too, you know, for extra credits. <sighs> Any decent security system will detect that you aren't in the military, much less part of my squad. I just say that I'm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The galaxy yeah. needed someone like you, Shepard. We all did. I had to do something. I don't have time for this burner. Get out of here and stop causing trouble. Oh, so that's how it is? Nobody can get the job done but you? You just wait, Shepard. I'll show you. I'll show you. Poor little dumbass. Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Um, I'm standing Who's right Farron? here, you know. He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. You don't know what that means to me, Shepard. I didn't know who you'd be when you came back. If you'd feel. They brought you back. And now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Progress here on uh Well, 
Well, I got quite a few options here, but like I said before, we're gonna. Are you okay? You seem touchy. It's not biotic neuroimaging, is it? I tried everything. Don't let anyone know, but I have the same thing. Eternal because you'll never believe what happened. I've got the data. Don't ask. Just call it a gift. Just spread the word. The family will be okay. Thank you again. You have no idea what this means to my family. I bet I don't. A Batarian trading group has announced plans to sue the Citadel Council. The Batarians claim that slavery is an inextricable part of their caste system. No, no, that still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. All the dangers are right. I'm telling you, relax. Dax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse mercs, some Justicar, I don't know. Nobody is ever going to see the extra merchandise, which is why we're going to be rich. I'm on a call. Sure you are. off those trace samples and get them back to the lab we got multiple shots fired yeah techs are going over the place now central we got an open carrier on this end switching to a coded relay what's going on this area is sealed off please step back sir sealed up why someone tried to kill your friend commander Shepard Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. You can't do that. Already done. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. A Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. So, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. What are the facts so far? About 25 minutes ago, someone took a shot at Tissoni. Note the bullet holes. She stuck around for almost four minutes before leaving the building. Whatever she was doing was important. If Liara isn't here, where is she? If I knew that, I wouldn't be sifting through her crap. There's no blood, no body. It looks like Tassoni got away. The sniper didn't plan on her kinetic barrier. Clever girl. Paranoid, but clever. Did the police find anything when they arrived? Just the mess and the bullet holes. I gave them a gold star for finding the bullet holes. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tassoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. like someone didn't like you much either. A doctorate from the University of Ceres, by Vanthesia. She's getting good use out of all that education. changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean-looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. 
Those things must be worth a fortune. Now I gotta be open. I would love to have this kind of apartment. But this is one of those multi-billion dollar uh, suites that only the rich and fancy people can have. It's Ilos. Vasir, I've got something here. Backup disc. Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sigat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Barrier Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony, you're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. Sounds like Liara found something big on the Shadow Broker. And then someone found her. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. The Barry of Frontiers offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Or maybe the party's just started. Is in there. They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. Frontier employee. Looks like he got caught in the explosion. I wouldn't take any bets on Sony's informant surviving that blast. Set bombs, killing everyone. Here. I 
found a military-grade explosive device. It hasn't been armed. Sloppy work. You use that kind of hardware when you don't have time to plan. Basir, I'm at the Barrier Frontier's office. We are assigned in just a few minutes ago. Understood, Commander. Welcome to Barrier Frontiers. Let us be your guide to limitless possibilities. Hello, good people. Basir, I pinned down. Mercs, and they're well armed. so far. Basir, these damaged pipes are on fire. They're blocking the stairs. Look for a switch to activate the fire suppressant systems. Got it. Should be clear now.
This is valuable. If I'd have been a few seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this a cat? Must have been. No sign of that data Liara talked about. Looks like a dead end. Uh, speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? The... Liara. Something I should know? This is the woman who tried to kill me. You've had a rough day, so I'll let that slide. Why don't you put that gun down? I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. So what? You were just using me to find the message? Nothing personal, Shepard. Just needed a little help tracking down Liara. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Sakat took his data and killed him. I'm guessing she's still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood bitch!
I'm fine, by the way. Thanks for asking. around the corner. She, we're not going into the construction site, are huh? Oh, goddess. I'm not letting her escape with that data. Go, 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 go! I'm going! Oncoming traffic! We'll be fine. She's dropping proximity charges. I noticed. She's got reinforcements. What kind of guns does this thing have? It's a taxi. It has a fare meter. Wonderful. Truck. I know. Truck! I know. <sighs> there we go. You're enjoying this. So this is just like all time, huh, the era? I am yeah. golden at this speed. Yeah, I hear those can be bad for you. Oh good, we're playing bumper cars. some damn backup. Watch out. They're dropping reinforce. There's Vizier's car. Come on, she can't have gotten far. Watch out. They're dropping reinforcements to slow us down. Thing it does something I. Yeah. 
Come on, she can't have gotten far. You don't do that. Lock the door. Not my presence, at least. Shoot your eyes. This should slow them down. Sweet! Watch out, flush them! <clears throat> They're using combat arrows. Going dark. Get up there. Oh. Oh. Question answered. Come on, we can climb over to get to Vizier's car. This should come in handy. Hey, we're unharmed. We didn't see anything. What kind of hotel is this? Azure. It's a luxury resort with an exotic edge. Hey, how's it Azure going there? Yeah, I took care of that uh moderator thing for you. Where? 
Mainly the lower reaches, near the bottom. I meant where on the Asari body. So did I. Give her that much. She's a specter. Why did the council appoint her as a specter? Who knows? Hmm. I'm just keeping an eye for extra items we can salvage. Like right here. There we go. Yeah, any time. You know what? There's actually one other thing I was going to announce, but I'll worry about it later. really surprising is that none of the patrons are a... It's over. Oh, there we go. Hey! Hey, you! Come here. What's your name? M mariana Mariana. You want to live, don't you? Tell those people that you want to live. Please. We'll get you out of here safely, Mariana. Well, that's good to hear. All you had to do was walk away. Now it gets ugly. Please, I have a son. A son? I hope he gets to see you again. I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children. Scars them for life. I'm going to end you, Fazir. It's okay, Leo. Oh, yeah. We'll handle it. You know, it's actually surprising. It's the should... fact that uh, even if you do lose a lot of blood, I believe the body's adrenal system uh, kicks into overdrive to keep you alive just long enough. Is that it? What? Vasir, I let the Destiny Ascension die with 10,000 people on board, including the Council. I unleashed the Rachni on the galaxy. So for your sake, I hope your escape plan doesn't hinge on me hesitating to shoot a damn hostage. You're bluffing. Now, Liara. <laughs> That's mad. We've been spotted. Dead. Watch out, shockwave. Got no shield. Now your cheese is really hard to eat. <laughs> Of course, uh, that is a true fact, but then again, this is just a game, so it's not meant to be taken seriously. Miss me? 
Oh yes, I did miss you. Yeah, I say you look as ugly as ever. Sarcasm. Personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been in power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Tell yourself whatever you like. The Council would never accept you working for the Shadow Broker. The Council? You pay them lip service while working for terrorists? You have any idea what Cerberus has done? I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps. Hell, your own unit on a coos. And you're with them. Don't you dare judge me. Don't you? Eliminate the Sony and retrieve the data. Civilian casualties not a concern. The Seer's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron. We'll get Farron out of there alive, Liara. I promise. I know. You're here to help. Just like always. That's not a good thing? When we first met on Therum, you saved me from the Geth. You fought a Krogan Battlemaster while I cowered. Now you're doing it again, and I'm still leaning on you for help. That's what friends do, Liara.
I can get us there based on Sakat's data. The Normandy stealth drive will keep them from detecting us. The Shadow Broker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. What's the plan when we get there? Get in, get fair, and get out. And kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. Will you just stop for a second? We'll be jumping several light years. There's time to talk. About what? About us. Shepard, listen. I'm... glad you're here. Are you worried there might be terminals you need me to hack? That's not fair. You were dead. I came back. It's not that easy. You can't just come back and have two years of mourning suddenly vanish. I'm sorry, Shepard. I can't get into this. For now, let's just focus on getting Farron back. Fine. Got the arrow back. boil during the day, then snap freeze ten minutes after sundown. The Shadow Broker lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? It wasn't really that difficult, Kira. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. I think it's just you need to have the right weapons. Because you need to have a weapon that takes down the barrier and then takes down the armor and then constant lightning storm with a and the rest should be just normal. Oh, I think you were talking about this part here. But we'll see. It also, I think also difficulty depends on uh, how fun this was. It's hard to pinpoint in this lightning, but I'm picking up signals from a communications array near the back of the ship. There's nothing below but maintenance equipment. We have to find an entrance near the back near ship. The back. Well, let's go to the back then. If you did this level, I think I like level 10. But I think that's just a rumor. Whether that's true or not, I don't know. Get out of the pests. Although, I think there's a DLC in either Mass Effect 3 or this game that is really, really hard. I just love it how we just had a clean hit. Sure you're real proud there, Morton. Sure you're real proud.
should be like this again, and you have to run around. There we go. There we go. Get ready to fight. Friendly fire!
I'm on it. With you. Agents love patrolling the home. At least the view is nice. There, that hatch leads directly to the communication signals. It's locked. Hang on, I've got a bypass shunt program that can crack it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one, anyway. Yeah, enjoy. You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them. Tell me you tested it. No time to talk. I don't know if you tested it. Making uh, contact. Enough. 
But at least the good news is we get to start from here. So that's the good news. You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warranty. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them. Tell me you tested it. No time to talk. Clean it. Slap Omni Gel on everything? That security upgrade made a lot of people unhappy. Look out, more on the way. Oh!
Hey, welcome back. Looks like you missed quite a bit of the action. But that's all right. Watch for biotics. Charging biotics. Did it bring up speed? Ready to find the shadow broker. That's all. Enemy biotics on the field. Layout. We're headed toward the prison block and Farron. Um, hi, excuse me. Um, where's the shadow broker? Getting you out of here. No. Farron. I thought this looked too easy. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now, and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to central operations. What's the point of this cage? I don't know. It's a neural grounding rod. The medical equipment is to make sure he doesn't expire. We have to shut this place down. Where did the broker get the mercs? Raised his own private force. They're completely loyal. Uh, uh, uh. Shepard, we really don't have the time. What do you know about the broker? He did this to me. I was hoping you'd know what he is. I never got a good look. But he's big. The guards are terrified of him. A Krogan? I don't know, but not everyone who visits his office comes back out. Tell us where to go. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to help those seas. Get in the Paint the farms.
Well, well, well. A shadow broker. Bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Ferrin for Our two years. My name? Dr. Think of it as Benjamin, but with the K in the beginning. And you know what? And you know what? Just for the record, not just for everyone, if you just want to call me Ken, I'm completely fine with that. You don't have to say the full name. Someone was bound to come after you for working with the Collectors. It was a mutually beneficial partnership. I like to try to keep my names as simple as possible, so that would make it easy for everyone. Be smart. Let Baron walk out with us. You won't be walking out at all. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. At least you brought me the Solarian to Sony. Grogan paid well for former Special Tasks Group members. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg, a pre-space flight species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery, which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter. Who wanted a slave? Or a pet? How am I doing? I think that answers your question. Oh, more to hurt in a bad more to hurt in a bad way. Shields kinetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way. Hit him now. Again. Get him to bring up that shield again. I've got an idea.
Well, looks like the Shadow Broker went broke. So now who's gonna take his place? Standard procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next solar day. Shadow Broker, out. Goddess of Oceans, it's you. You. How? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead. So. You're the new Shadow Broker. It'll be nice to have access to information I can trust. Broker. I... I'm not sure I'm ready for you to call me that. I'm not sure about any of this, but I had to do it. With the Shadow Broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll... check the power systems. different people. You have your mission, and for now, we need to figure out our options. No safeguards or user restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here, and it's all ours. Sure you want to stay here? I could use you on the Normandy. I have to stay here. We can't pass this up, Shepard. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Broker's network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. Welcome back, Shadow Broker. What's this? That's the old broker's VI assistant. It's actually been helpful with rebuilding the network. Please let me know if I can organize anything else for you, Shadow Broker. It also thinks anyone in the room is the broker. I'll play around with the settings later. My manual is ready whenever you have a moment.
I think once we get more... Oh, Spotify ads are annoying. Yeah, I agree, especially if you don't have premium. What are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. And now it's ours. You're not gonna turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? I can understand the temptation. I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. But I've got a purpose. Helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. You know, relatively speaking. If you're in over your head, we could just crash this thing and walk away. That's just it. In a way, I feel like I belong here. Working on my own, I was always hunting for leads. With the Shadow Broker's resources, it's about organizing, cataloging. I've got everything, Shepard. This is a dream job. Although, the location could be better. Have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. He knew you weren't lying about your visions of the Prothean Beacon. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. You know, I didn't come down here just to talk about data. I know. We have some unfinished business. But just because we were together before... I miss you, but it's been two years. I don't want to put pressure on you. I've got fond memories of the last time you put pressure on me. <laughs> so do I. Why don't you come to the Normandy for drinks? I'd like that. Good. Get your things and come on up. Okay, thanks. I'll be right there. Just give me a minute. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship. And I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although, he did ask me to record any parts of our conversation where... my eyes do that freaky black eternity thing. <sighs> of course he did. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but I recovered your tags. I thought I'd never see these again. You can't get back everything you lose, but sometimes you get lucky. Yeah, that was the plan. How are you actually doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. I 
I'm okay. Really. It's been rough, but we'll get it done. You've certainly made a good start, even if those idiots on the Council won't admit it. There wouldn't be a man, woman, or child left on Horizon, if not for you. You know the worst part of it? Cerberus planted intel to lure the Collectors there. Horizon was bait. Those bastards. They'd have hit another world if we hadn't lured them there, but... Aren't you gonna tell me not to work with them? I gave them your body, remember? What should I say? And I trust you. You'll stick to your beliefs no matter what Cerberus wants. So tell me what you want. If this all ends tomorrow, what happens to us? I don't know. Marriage, old age, and a lot of little blue children? You just say these things. Goddess, you were dead. I got better. This time, but you're going to leave again. When your team is ready, you'll leap through the Omega-4 relay. I spent two years mourning you. So if we're going to try this, I need to know you're always coming back. I'm always coming back. Are you sure? I haven't stayed dead yet. You make a compelling argument. Oh, I'm just getting started. Here we go again. Received a new message at your private terminal. Well, you know, well, you know what? I think this is where we're going to stop for now. Thanks to those who watch. Thanks to those who joined me in the chat. I'll see everybody next time.